Why, hello everybody! It is Bear 58 here today, and man, don't I have something special planned out for you. Now, as you guys are going to see what the title of the video is, I am taste testing something from my place of work, Taco John's. I just got off work, so I'm not promoting anything or, any, or anybody like that, but I have been curious about this type of new item. We had it last year, but this one, the cheese is somewhat different, and we made it a different way than last year. So what I'm about to eat on, eat on camera is known as the quesadilla taco. Now the quesadilla taco basically has, is a sh soft shell type of taco with two shells where there's pepper jack cheese in the middle, melted on the grill for about 35 seconds. And then it is gonna get topped with, I got chicken, you can get it in beef or steak. Then it is going to get lettuce. It is going to get pico. Oh no, I forgot, I did that out of order. So, it is going to get the shells, of course. You know what, enough of me jibber jabbering. I'm gonna play the video for you right now that I recorded of the one that I'm about to eat being made. So here we go. What you guys are gonna see right now is we put two of these shells on the griddle to warm up the shells, flip them over and warm them up on each side. Then we are going to be putting it down on the cold table and putting I believe it's just one slice of pepper jack cheese on one piece and then we're gonna put the other one over it put it on the grill and then it's gonna get put down for about 35 seconds to get that nice and melted this year we're using sliced cheese instead of shredded pepper jack cheese which was a lot harder to work with and then once it comes off the grill we're gonna be forming it into the form of a taco and then it's gonna then I got chicken and then it's gonna get the creamy chipotle sauce sorry if it's not coming out in a nice smooth stream we just got done making another bottle and then it is going to get topped with lettuce and pico and then it gets folded up and wrapped up as a taco and that is basically what I'm gonna eat on camera for you guys I have not personally had the quesadilla tacos every time we've always gotten the quesadilla tacos or last year when we got them I always took the shredded cheese and stuff and uh, sauce like that and put into my own things like a burrito or something so today we are actually going to try this on camera and i know you guys are asking where my wife is and she's at home like i said i just got done with work so what's going to be happening is in the future with pill talk productions i know there hasn't been any content up on that channel in a long time we just got done doing another reaction that i plan on putting it up there and then i'm going to go ahead and if you guys want to see some more taste testing videos, not just with me, but with my wife, please let me know. But here we go. So, quesadilla taco, chipotle, chip, creamy chipotle chicken. And when you guys open it up, I'm going to see if I can adjust the camera here real quick. So, right here, I'm opening it up. And as you guys can see, oh, cheese is pretty melted. And um, here we are. This here is the quesadilla taco. Has the pico, like I said. And it's nice and warmed up. Can you see the steam coming off of that? If not, I'm not even mad. And then right here in between, like I said, is the cheese. Look at that, oh, look at that. So I'm gonna go ahead and try this out now. And then chipotle sauce, you can see it come, oh. I wanna make sure I don't lose any of it. You guys can kinda see it right there. It's really good sauce too. It's really good. It goes really well with chicken. So here we go. First quesadilla taco I ever had, and I know that might be saying I'm lying about that, but I really was never interested in them. Just I didn't really care for them, but I'm gonna give it a shot. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Hold on. All right. First impression that I like about it is I like pepper jack cheese. The first thing I tasted was the pepper jack cheese. And then once that got with the chipotle sauce, that was really good. Pico is a nice touch too. When we make the pico in the morning, I we always hand pick our cilantro. I've been doing prep this week, so I had to do that. And um, it came out real nice with that nice lime flavor and everything. So overall, I recommend getting the quesadilla taco from, I've never even said where it was from, the Buffalo, oh, I did at the beginning, but the Buffalo Taco John's in Minnesota, 
that's where I got mine. That's where I am at. That's where I work. And then, um, but any Taco John's you guys go to in the United States, I don't know how far out they are, mostly in the Midwest. Some on the, there's some out in the more coastal areas, I believe. But I believe that the Midwest, we have nine stores in central Minnesota that my owner has. So if you guys live in that area, go ahead and grab one of these. Or if you have a Taco John's in your area, go ahead and try out the Chipotle chicken quesadilla taco. It is amazing. Next thing I'm gonna try on camera is, I already had one of these the other day on break, but is the Taco Perfecto. A nine inch hard shell with your choice of beef, Chipotle chicken, or steak. Beef and steak, they get house salsa, shredded cheese, lettuce, and tomatoes. And I have only had the chicken one. The chicken is really great on that, but I really wanna try the beef and steak just because A, I've never had the house salsa. I have never tried it. I'm curious on how it is on one of those things. And just the protein difference. Like, I've, of course, I had beef on a hard shell taco. But the steak, the steak I have not. So we're going to give that a shot next time I make one of these. But um, overall, I'm happy about what I got. And I'm definitely going to be trying to get a couple more of these here in the future. They're not going anywhere. These items are permanent, by the way. The Taco Perfecto and the Quesadilla Tacos are permanent items on the menu. So, if you guys are curious about this, go ahead and get it. It is really tasty. You guys will like it, all right? However, I got to get home. It's cold. It's in Minnesota. It's cold. And I'm going to go ahead and put this video together for you. You guys should be seeing a reaction with me and my wife on the Pillow Talk channel here soon. Very soon. I got to get home and edit it. And then, if you guys have not seen my two most recent videos, which are reaction videos, please go check that out down below. I'll try it. I know I'm not really good at cards, but I'll try to get better at doing the cards. And if I'm looking to the left for some odd reason, my camera right now is on the right because of the steering wheel. So it's a lot better on the left side. That's why I like looking to the left more than the right. But you guys know what I mean. Hopefully you do. However, if you guys want to check out me, check me out on social media. Follow me there. My link tree is down below where it goes to all my social media in one spot. Humble bundles down below too. I can use those to help raise money for Extra Life. You can get awesome things in there too, like sometimes cookbooks, books on programming, even bundles of video games, and it all goes to a good cause. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you guys like the outro music right now, go check out the homie RJ. He's fantastic, phenomenal, and he's a really great person to get to know and hang out with and talk to. But um, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are having a great day, weekend, birthday, holiday, whenever you're watching this. All right? This is Toy Bear 58 Toodles. Toodles.